beautiful, aren't they? Hello guys, and oh, oh I'm surrendering for some reason. <laughs> Hello guys, and welcome back to Ark Survival Evolved on the Miniolithic Age server. As you can see behind me, we have these two beautiful Quetzals, and uh, yeah, as well as a couple of Archies that we'll probably get into later this episode. But in between this episode and the last one, we had the New Year's event, and the kangaroos came out, guys! Now, there was a little bit of drama with the kangaroos, and I'll, I'll and that with the kangaroos with the New Year's event that I don't care to get into, but uh, basically we kind of missed out on it, but it's okay because it was just a top hat skin. And uh, it was well worth it for this male Quetzal named Bez and this female Anuket. As you can see, Viri has painted her saddle. And uh, yeah, guys, uh, you guys may notice that the game is actually crisper and clearer. Hello, Raptor Claws! Uh, and also that it looks different. Well, I'm experimenting with a couple of settings, and I want to let you guys know what you think. Uh, but for a comparison, I recorded the kangaroo, uh, the capturing of the kangaroo and the taming of the kangaroo in that pen. Uh, so guys, I want you to watch this next segment and let me know what you guys think. And I'll see you guys in just a little bit. There it is, there it is, there it is, there it is. There he is, there he is, there he is, there he is. Come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. You look like a bird. Now, can I pick you up? Please tell me I can pick you up. Oh, miss, hold on, let's try that again. Oh, Rainbow Dash, slow down just a bit. Why are you running away? I'm not, I, I swear, I just want to take you to a new life. <gasps> oh, I can't, oh, it's only level eight. Well, beggars can't be choosers. And I'll be the first one on the server. And we don't really know the use of it yet. Okay, so- Oh my god, you have such a grumpy face. Holy crap. Okay, we're taking this guy. He's gonna be called Bad Attitude. He's got tiger stripes, I like that. Uh, where the hell am I? Alright guys, I'll, I'll see you back at the base. And we are back at the base and I have lost our Joey. That's what a male kangaroo is, I do believe. Or that maybe be a baby male kangaroo. Uh, we're gonna close this up because very left the gate open. But this is our new taming center, as I can, you know, show you when I stop lagging. Oh, there he is, there he is, there he is. Up, 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 up. Of course, I'm probably lagging because I'm recording in the wrong settings, but that's okay. X and let go. And why do you fall so far to the side? Ah! Right, let's try this again. Are they like huge? Okay, it keeps falling over to my right. No, you're not going over there because there's turrets over there and there's also creatures that would want to eat your face. Alright, let's try this again. Uh, let's move just a touch forward and boop. You in? You in? Yes! He's in, guys! Okay. So, first of all, let's get you settled. And do I have my narcotic and stuff? Okay, I have my narcotics in here, trank darts. Yeah, that's good. Um, it's a level 8, so I'm going to need to be very, very careful in how I knock it out. Because I don't want to kill it. I don't want to kill it, um, so I'm not going to be using my crossbow. I'm using trank darts. Oh my god, you're a beautiful creature. Oh, <gasps> he tilts his ears back to the sleep. Oh. Oh, you're grumpy. Oh, I can't see a thing. All right, I am sorry. Okay, took one trank dart so far. And I shot it right in the face, as you guys can see. I can't see anything. Hey! Aw, oh, you run for me, I'm sorry. You're so cute! That's two, right in the butt. Oh! <laughs> you have an earring. You, you look like Grumpy Cat. Oh, stand still for two seconds. That's three, and that one's right in the face, right in the kisser. Oh! These guys are fast, man. <gasps> okay, how much torpor do you have? Because we still have yet to determine. You have 400 torpor. Holy crap, sticks! Alright, I'm gonna go. 
good. All right, let's grab dodo kibble, see if it needs dodo kibble. Uh, meat and berries. Ah! Son of a... Double tap D. Uh, and we're going to need narcotic. Come on the devil, on the devil. Let's do this. Let's do this! I'm so nervous, guys. It's I'm so exciting! Oh my god! 400 torpor, though. That's, that's, uh... I mean, it's, it's not bad, but it's not a lot. Then again, what am I expecting? It's, it's a, it's a level of creature. Alright, um, let's take some cooked crime. Uh, I'm berries. I have some berries. Um, what else are those? I'm gonna get? Dodo kibble, dodo kibble. Do I have any other kibble? Uh, well, I have stuff to make other kibble. Alright, let's take half a stack. Let's see if it eats that. And then we'll work our way up, I guess. Cause I don't know what it eats. <sighs> or if it's a carnivore. Oh, Rimbadash, Rimbadash. Why am I running Rimbadash? Help me. Rimbadash a second. Let's go! Oh, the moon's pretty. Okay, uh, do you eat meat? Alright, it's food is down. What the heck? What did these guys eat? Wait a minute, wait a minute. Okay, well, maybe it's- maybe it's a raw meat eater. You guys are probably screaming, Lo, Lily, it's tamed with such and such. Is it tamed with raw meat? There's some berries. Okay, I got kibble. I don't have prime. I can go and get prime, but it looks like a herbivore. You guys, uh, you have to understand this. This patch just dropped like yesterday for me. So if if you guys know the answer and are yelling it at the screen, I need you to yell louder. And I'm gonna go and see if there's any information about this creature. <laughs> Holy crap! Wait a minute! Oh, it really only eats rare mushrooms? Well, eat up, bud. Holy crap! What kind of crap is that? Oh, well, there goes my mind wipe tonic I wanted to make, but I guess that's okay. Damn. That's, uh, that's a bit obscure. I wonder if it mentions that in the, uh, dossier and I just miss it. Well, I guess, uh... On the positive note, though, um, you, you put that stuff in, and it, uh, I don't know. It does what it does, I guess. Oh. Well, guys, that's a little obscure. I'm not sure how I feel about that. Let's see what level the Proctogon saddle is. Proc- Proc- Proc-, proc Hold on, wait. Let me look at this creature. Proc-Cop-Togon. pro cop pro cop there we go, for crap stone. Much better with uh, Latin than I am anything. So, pro coptodon settle. I can only be crafted on a smithy, that's fine. I need the grenade to learn that. Okay. I'm excited though, I want to see how this thing works. Alright, guys, I will see you guys when I've got this guy all tamed up. And. Yeah, you'll see me writing about it with the saddle. We'll see how well it does. I called him Joey. Joey, here. Joey, let's get a good look at you. Come here, Joey. Joey. Thank you, bud. Oh, you have such a grumpy face. Oh my god. Alviri's not going to be on for a little while. That doesn't mean we can't put this guy to the test. Oh, let's get this off of you. You're a herbivore. That's probably making you sick. There we go. Now. So it took about, I think, six uh, rare mushrooms to tame a level eight, and I think he ate at uh, 75 or 100 food loss, 
So when it's uh, 100 food less than the actual level, anyway. So we'll be so Probably barely hear me. Oh, this guy is fast. Woo! Now, are you any good at gathering materials? So let's walk you up to a tree. And okay, looks like it eats a tree, which is good for getting thatch. But it varies. Good for getting berries? No, it can't get its own berries. I wonder if it's better for getting the rare mushrooms. I mean, I did find it on a mountain, so that would make sense. Are you gonna get it getting a flint with that uh, stone? No. Okay. Now, what's your melee damage at? It's only at that. I'm kind of curious if it actually rears up on its hind legs to kick something. So we're gonna go find something to attack. Oh my god, this thing is such a high jumper. This is amazing. Oh, there's raptor claws. Hi, raptor claws. Oh, my raptor claws. Oh, wait, this is okay. Trugmanite. There we go. Alright, now let's see. One. Two. Oh, it kicked it back. I can't see anything. Yeah, I can't. I lost it, I think. Damn. Okay, so first person viewing on this mount is alright if you're looking straight ahead. Whee! Oh, that's cool! Alright, how much damage did you take from that? Oh, very minor. Holy crap, guys. Alright, I'm gonna have to get Viri on here later, and we're gonna experimenting with the pouch. Um, on one of the news releases says that in the pouch there's supposed to be a gun of some sort? I don't know. Sorry, I'm checking out your pouch. Wait a minute, why does a dude have a pouch? Wait a minute. Alright, now I gotta look this up. And I'm gonna look this up and I will have more information, but I don't think male marsupials have pouches. Um, I'm gonna go look this up. See guys, my, my specialty is mammals, and while marsupials are technically part of the mammal family, I never spent too much time researching them because, well, I live in America, the only marsupial we have is the uh, possum, and therefore, you know, I don't know. So I'm going to research this, and you guys will see me back with Viri in just a minute. You are adorable, despite the snow. You don't want to look at me on the face? No? Okay. He's grumpy, guys. He's grumpy. <laughs> anyway, see you guys. So, as I'm working on stuff and things around the base, I found this 10 female, 104 female Ankleo, which will be just perfect as Varus's companion. So, we're gonna go ahead and quickly knock her out and hopefully surprise Viri. Oh, oh no! Don't you destroy that. It's metal. You can't anyway. Are you really trying to flee? I guess it's because the torpor is so high. Let's see if I can't get a headshot here. Uh, come on. Come on. You're looking like you're sluggish. I don't know if that's an actual feature, if that's just me. Imagining things. It's probably me imagining things. Come on now. Go down. Oh, up, 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 up. Let's not do that. I love this taming pit that uh, Yuri made. It's amazing. It's perfect. Metal walls, metal foundations, stone everything else. Oh, that was a list. Hi! How are you today? Uh, let's not have you attack the ladder, please. Get your butt. Come on now. Come on now. Man, these take a lot of narc. She down? She's down! Okay, great. Let's see what it... Okay. Oh, this is gonna be great. Alright, well, I'll see you guys when this is all tamed up. Alright, oh. she's on her last bit of food. It looks like she should tame out, and I'm excited. A 104. Perfect tame. I put the berries on there just in case I calculated it wrong. We have the taming rates turned up. 
uh, so as to help with people who are new or don't understand ARC or frankly don't have the time to grind to be able to get in, explore the game, have fun with the game, and do all sorts of cool things. So come on now. Oh, here we go, here we go. We're gonna, we're gonna do that real quick to encourage her eating a little bit more. And she'll came out really high, and I think Viri is going to be very happy. I'm starving. Uh, you're not gonna eat these, so I'm gonna eat these. But I wanna see you tame out first. Woohoo! I'm going to give it a little heart so Viri knows it's for him. And a 155, a 104 to 155, guys. And that is how you perfect tame an Ankleo. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Hello, guys. And as you can see behind me, the winter update is done. Woohoo! Oh, wrong one. Is it this one? Nope, okay, I don't have the animation set, but that is no matter. Uh, as you can see, the winter update is done. We have updated, the, actually, we updated this morning to 231.1. And uh, this, this is a bit of a game changer, guys, because they've reset the dinosaur stats to how they used to be. A.K.A., um, we're actually going to go and... Up. I can't jump up the top when I'm saddle still. I am going to run over here. Um, my RG, Rainbow Dash, I had worked hard to get her up to a thousand melee damage. And I was very proud of that fact. And now, her melee damage is now down to 371. Now this is not, they did not nerf it. What they have done is they've changed how much a stat increases. So, as I run back over here, I should have done a little bit more planning, guys. I should have had RD up up on Mogo, but, you know, that that environs, it requires, you know, planning and stuff and things. But, anyway, so, um, now I hadn't had a chance to level her up. As you can see, she, this is her first level. She's already got a bit of experience. So, we're going to go ahead and give her melee damage. Now, you see, that was a very, very small increase. In fact, I do believe... I want to say that was 2%. So, guys, be be conscientious of that. that. However, they did a minor patch in which uh, the gather rates aren't so terrible. Um, in fact, I'm glad that they did because I was trying to gather wood for uh, on Wooly, Wooly Allen. And uh, it, was, it was quite terrible. Anyway, so, guys, I'm going to go ahead and let you know that uh, me and Viri, we didn't get a chance to record. However, he did find me this wonderful Proctodon. Procoptodon, which I'm actually going to name right now, to Jack. That way we have Jack and Joey. And uh, that's not the most stereotypical name at all, is it, Jack? I didn't think so. Anyway, so if, in case you guys were curious, you can board the pouch instantly, and it looks like this. And I can't access K mode or do selfie mode or anything like that. Get out, you press E. Or you can ride. Now, I'm about to do a little bit of time travel for you guys. I'm going to guess that by next week, me and Viri will have discovered that you can make a delectable beverage, and we'll be probably spending some time working on that together. And I will be putting in hours for working on a very special project that is up and over this hill here. As you can see, the dino gate opening. Oh, Lady Giga moved. Lady Giga, are you mad? Her eyes are a little bit glowy. You okay? Are you hungry? Wait, hold on. I gotta make sure Lady Giga's hungry. I don't like her. No, she has food. Okay, good. Anyway, so guys, this is the barn. <laughs> uh, I've been working on this a little bit, and as you can see, I'm able to fit the Giganotosaurus in here with, like, room to spare. Um, this is a big project. This is going to take me a little while. As you can see, i got the foundations here, and uh, right now it does have an Achilles heel, but I'll be patching that in with stone foundations. And, yeah, guys, this, this is, this is going to be a big project. Um, I was testing, actually, with Mogo and Lady Giga, and found out that I could fit them both in here perfectly. However, I didn't want to do that for a while, because uh, Mogo is the natural prey of Giganotosauruses, so I didn't want to do that to her. There's a dodo over here! Hold on, wait, what level is this dodo? It almost looks like a bunny for a second. 
We're also on the lookout for a 120 dodo that we can perfect tame for some later shenanigans. But guys, uh, that's going to be it for this week. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, remember to press that like button. And if you really did enjoy, then make sure to subscribe. And if you guys didn't like it, then uh, go ahead and subscribe for more videos that you'll probably dislike. Anyway, guys, <laughs> let me know on what you guys think of the overall view of the shaders and view of the game. I actually kind of like it. I think it's, um, it kind of gives it more of a, a, a matte finish, an M-A-T-T-E, I don't know how do you, is that mate? Maybe. I don't know. I don't know how you pronounce that, guys. But I, I feel it kind of gives it that sort of finish, and as long as I leave light shafts on, I think it looks pretty. In fact, where's, there's the noonday sun. Anyway, guys, so just let me know what you guys think in the comments down below, and I hope you guys really did enjoy, and I'm gonna stop, you know, rambling on before, you know, <laughs> this is so much fun. <laughs> oh, there's Megaprana in there. <laughs> uh, quick, Jack! Jump over the Megaprana! Uh-oh, we're stuck. No, we're not stuck. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Alright, guys. See you guys!